Big story tonight and the possible reason why a Mesa man is in the hospital right now. Police blame an angry wife, 28-year-old Holly Solomon, but she blames her husband's choice not to vote in last week's election. ABC 15's Brian Webb is here to explain and Brian, walk us through this one. Police say it started with a shouting match and then Holly Solomon got into her car and tried to run over her husband as he hid behind light poles for safety, all while a big group of people was watching and several of them called 911. 911, where's the emergency? Uh, yes, uh, this woman just ran down her boyfriend or husband in the parking lot. Somebody just got ran over here. Okay. We just had a kid get hit by a car. No, ma'am, there's somebody who got hit by a car or something's going on yeah, right now. So you're calling about the accident. Police say Daniel Solomon managed to dodge the car several times with his wife behind the wheel, screaming at him each time she passed. But then he tried to make a run for it, and it didn't turn out to be a good move. His wife sped toward him, ran over him, pinning her husband under the car and up against a curb. Daniel Solomon is now in critical condition. The couple's neighbors in Mesa admit they don't know much about the Solomons, but do know enough to call this situation silly and sad. I think it's completely silly that marriage can get broken up by something political. I think um, families should be able to stay stronger than what's going on in the government right now. And those charges against Holly Solomon could be upgraded if her husband Daniel dies. Now, Katie, police tell us Holly Solomon admitted she did this because she was mad her husband didn't vote last week, and she's afraid her family will suffer more hardships under four more years of President Obama. Just a wild story. Thank you, Brian.